Hey everyone, Kiwi King 77 here from the AC Syndicate team here to do a video showing you how to install official MIUI ROM on your Samsung Epic 4G. It's now official, it's on MIUI's website, uh, so that's very awesome. Actually, ACS member Xbox FanJ has got this going. Uh, he had a little help as well, so thanks to him, as well as Marcus Sant, Death 259 and BXFXF. So thanks to all those guys for putting this together for us. But anyways, it is an MTD ROM, so keep that in mind. If you haven't watched my video on MTD on the Samsung Epic 4G, I highly recommend it. I'll link to that in the description. But anyways, all you need is Clockwork Mod for uh, to flash this ROM. So click on the link in the description. It will probably take you to the ACS website. We're doing a little site maintenance right now, so I can't show you to it. But then click on the link on the ACS website. It will take you to the MIUI website, as you can see. Uh, and just scroll down. Keep scrolling down, keep scrolling down until on the left side you see Samsung Epic 4G right there. So, as you can see, it's right there. It's officially supported. Click on it and then you got the download right there. So download ROM right there. Only thing that doesn't work is WiMAX. So keep that in mind. It does not have 4G working yet. I'll keep you updated if 4G starts working. But anyways, so just click on download ROM. It'll look something like this right here. MIUI. Victory 4G 1 12 23 right there. So just get that zip file on your SD card. So make sure you transfer it on over to your Epic 4G. Once it's there, you are ready to go. Go ahead and uh, power off your device. I'm going to reboot into, oh, I guess I'm just going to go ahead and power it on off then. So I'll power off my Epic 4G. I'm running the MTD CM7 ROM. You can be on a BML ROM, that doesn't matter. It's just after you flash an MTD ROM, you cannot uh, revert back to a BML ROM without using Odin to go back to stock first. So keep that in mind. I'm gonna go in, uh, now that this is powered off, I'm gonna go into Clockwork Mod, volume down, camera button, and power button all at the same time. I'm gonna press and hold it. I press and hold till the bottom backlit keys light up, like so. And it should reboot me into my custom recovery. All right, so rebooted me into my custom recovery. Uh, Clockwork Mod 5.0.2.7, right there. And now, what you're gonna need to do to install this ROM is, first of all, make an Android backup. So go to Backup and Restore, make an Android backup of your current setup. Once that's done, what I'm gonna recommend you do is just go to Wipe Data, Factory Resets, and hit Yes, Delete All User Data. So as I said, this is gonna wipe all your data, so make sure you back everything up, your contacts, your apps, messages, anything that needs to be backed up. Once data wipes complete, go to Wipe Cache Partition, hit Yes, Wipe Cache, and then go to the Advanced menu, and hit Wipe Dalvik Cache, and hit Yes, Wipe Dalvik Cache. So once all three of those are wiped, hit the back arrow, Install zip from SD card, choose zip from SD card, and then find that uh, MIUI.us ROM that should be on your Epic. Mine should be somewhere on here. And it is right there. MIUI.us Victory 4G 112.23. So select it, hit yes, and let it install. So it's going to go ahead and install MIUI on my Epic 4G. I'm going to go ahead and let it uh, do its thing and I'll be back once it's done. Be patient with the install process. All right, installation is done. Install from SD card complete. Just hit the back arrow and then just hit reboot system now. So go ahead and reboot your device. And once it boots up, you'll be running the MIUI ROM on your Samsung Epic 4G. Uh, this ROM is actually pretty cool. Um, but do not flash any other kernel. So keep that in mind. Just keep the kernel that comes with this ROM. I'm going to be doing a separate review video. So I'm going to go ahead and let you guys check out the boot animation. But I'm also going to be doing a separate review video. So definitely going to want to check that out. Um, I'll link to that in the description of the video. But anyways, as you can see, just the Android, MIUI Android startup screen. So very nice. But uh, be sure to subscribe to me for future videos. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. Plus. All links will be down in the description. And as always, thanks for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up and watch that review video.